What's up, my beautiful people? I am back. <laughs> uh, today, I am not doing a try on. Woo, nah. <laughs> So today I decided to do like a review on my handbags that I that I have. Um, I am not so much of a bag girl. Um, I know like there's like collectors of you know things like that, and I am not. I usually tend to stick to one bag and um, wear it the most, and it can be you know a cheap bag or it could be an expensive bag. Um, uh, pretty much all my bags are like pretty much Coach or Michael Kors, but um, I do have like a couple of Aldo, I have an Aldo and I have like a No Frills one from I think from like Forever 21. So, um, but um, I'm gonna go through, I'm not all of them, just a couple of them. Um, and I actually tried selling a couple of these because um, they're they're fairly old <laughs> and I don't wear them like I said I'm not like a big bag person so um, anyway I'm gonna just start with this one right here um, which is um, my coach wristlet this one I actually got as a gift um, from an old job that I used to work at I used to to work in a dental office I was a dental assistant and they gifted us um, coach wristlets and they gave us a couple of other things as well um, so the company was really nice I'm no longer with them um, but yeah so they gave me this coach wristlet I was new to the um, job to, to the company and um, so I got a wristlet I think everybody else got like a real bag <laughs> so because I was new I had the smaller, the smallest thing, <laughs> which is cool because you know it's just a sign of appreciation. And they also gave me, I think, um, I think a Pandora bracelet, so which is also very nice of them. So yeah, so this I got from there. Um, this is like a few years ago. This is like an old model version, and um, I don't wear it often because I hate having things in my hand. Um, Occasionally, I do wear it if I'm just going to like the store and I just want to grab something. I just throw it on there like that, or I link it around my um, belt loops and I'll hold on to it like that. But other than that, I don't really use it often. I think I even tried to sell it. I'm not even 100 sure. <sighs> Next, oh, this is one is very old. It's a Coach and I haven't worn it in forever. I don't think I even wore it that often. Um, it's still in like pretty mint condition, just slightly dusty, but there's barely any wear and tear on it because I didn't use it much. And I think I got this as a Christmas gift. Ta-da! Do you girls remember this style bag? This was like the bomb in the early 2000s. <laughs> this was so in style. But I never really wore it much. And the leather is like in great condition and everything. There's like no stains, no nothing on it whatsoever. I think I maybe used this like twice. nothing so I believe I try to sell this one as well um, because I just don't use it um, like I said I don't, I don't use my bags a lot um, so that was that one that's a coach and then have this little coach one as well which is super cute this one I did use um, often um, it's just your plain simple black bag and it's like more of a handbag I mean you can throw it on the shoulder if you want but it's more for the hand and like I said I hate having things in my hand but 
back when I got it. I did use it a lot. Um, and it's just still super cute. I mean, it's like a classic bag. You can't go wrong. It's just a black bag. You can wear it with anything, for anything. So, and the leather is still in great condition. I keep them in like little cloth bags so they do not get messed up just in case I sell it or decide to use it I still want them to look presentable and I got um, this I'll show you this one next I mean, last because that's the one I wear all the time but then I got this beautiful Michael Kors bag um and this one i did wear quite often um the only thing it's still in great condition though there's no like mix or anything on it or on the bottom um the only thing i will say about this michael kors bag is that it is heavy oh my god let me tell you like it's fairly heavy and there's nothing in here right now it, oh there is I have the um, extended strap I'll show you guys um this is what I have in there you know the extendable strap you can make it a shoulder bag and it's heavy so imagine putting crap in here oh my god like your arm is gonna be super tired and I have like I have like a bad shoulder or whatever so I can't even hold this bag but I do wear it occasionally like if I'm going someplace really nice and I want to look like you know more bougie <laughs> which I don't really like to be bougie <laughs> but uh, when I just want to have like a different appearance or appear more you know whatever um, I do wear this one. I love it. it has the li little logo and You know, it's very nice. It's very well made and you can carry a ton of shit in here. I tell you um, You can put like two outfits <laughs> Your hair blower <laughs> It is very big. Oh, I have the um, cloth that I keep it in as well It is super duper big so I do wear it, but I do keep it clean. Like there's no yucky inside either. And I do like this bag, though. I, I like it a lot. I've debated selling it because I it's just so heavy. But I want a nice quality bag. Um, you know, any name brand would be fine um but that's not so heavy because like a handbag that's not so heavy and last but not least this is like my everyday bag i it's a michael kors bag as well i love this bag it's like perfect i wear it across my shoulder like this and i'm gone so this bag i use all the time because I just love it. I think it's just so cute and it's light. And I love the straps. I love the detailing. I probably have crap in here. Yeah, I do. I have some stuff in here. <laughs> because I wear it all the time. So, this one I really, really like. Um, the material is, is very well made. It's strong, sturdy. And as much as I worn it, like there's no nicks or scratches or anything on it. So you can tell that the um, material is very well made. So kudos to Michael Kors because the material is really good on the bag. I was debating on getting another one, same one, same style, but in a different color. Because as you can see, all my bags are black and brown. <laughs> you know maybe a little something something with a little more oomph in it I don't know um, actually I saw this coach bag that I did like um, obviously I've seen other um, brands that I like too um, I think my goal I'm really aiming for like a Gucci backpack style or a Gucci fanny pack 
because fanny packs have been my thing uh, as well because when I don't wear this one I usually wear my forever 21 um, little fanny pack because I don't have to have anything on my shoulders because I suffer from <laughs> uh, uh, muscle spasms and stuff and my shoulder is messed up so I usually um, try to I'll wear my fanny pack um, you know or this bag but this one even still like if I wear it too long my back starts to hurt my shoulder starts to hurt so I'm just falling apart man <laughs> but anyway um, yeah so that's my my goal Gucci fanny pack um, I'm really trying to get um, get one of those or backpack um, where I can level out whatever I'm on both of my shoulders um, yeah and that's it um, which one would I recommend I would definitely recommend um, the shoulder one by Michael Kors you know it's light and it's so easy and you can just as small as it looks you can pretty you can fit enough in here um, definitely all your essentials your wallet cell phone keys you know fit perfectly in here and you know it's not it's not that late and you can wear it with anything so go ahead girl get yourself one um, but um, I do of course I do love my other ones as well and the big um, big Michael Kors one I like also but this one is definitely my go-to or my fanny pack, which I didn't show because it's like beat up because <laughs> I wear it a lot. So yeah, so that's it for my bag review. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Let me know what kind of bags you recommend um, for someone that suffers with like back issues, neck, shoulder. Um, let me know out down in my comments uh, bags that are, you know, well made and lightweight because I'm always into something like that um my coach bags i have retired pretty much um and i pretty much just use two bags uh when i go you know if i'm going anywhere i usually use this one for my fanny pack so yeah let me know some recommendations even some fanny packs or backpacks that you guys uh know are lightweight and are good brand good quality let me know in the comments because i'm definitely looking for a new one or even something you know that's just fun and flirty that i can wear on a night out or something let me know <laughs> anyway guys that's it for this video i hope you guys enjoyed my little review and um i will catch you guys up on the next one like always don't forget to like share and subscribe Comment down below. Hit me up in my comments. I do try to get back to you guys as much as possible. And also, don't, definitely, definitely don't forget to check me out on my Patreon page, which is patreon.com slash Jasmine Guzman, where you'll find exclusive videos that you will never find here. <laughs> anyway, guys, catch you guys on the next one. Later!